The latest show to open at Sujo Creek featured contemporary performing art. A large audience crowded in to watch the unique combination of dancing, singing, and even Tai Chi. This is an interdisciplinary multimedia performance. Um, it's designed to be more interactive, so the audience is surrounded by the performance, not merely watching on one side. They are involved in the entire performance. It includes music, dance, improvisation, and video. The experimental idea was carried out by a group of artists made of local talents and international expats including Amy. They had tried and failed to hold the performance at many other places, but they finally found a place willing to accept them for free. The only reason we can perform here in Creek Art is because they give us the opportunity to use the space and to rehearse here for free. That's the only reason we can do it. Oh, we don't need to pay some money for this. It's made just like a, a cooperation with Creek Art. But Creek Art needs to spend some money for us, for the music machine, for some details. Thing. Housed in a factory building from the late Qing Dynasty, Creek Art is styling itself as a breeding ground for creativity and innovation. Besides sponsoring this performance, they also hold art exhibitions. And on the top floor, it runs a cafe and restaurant. We want to, to be more an exhibition space and experience place. So we try to, to let the cafe and bar and also to rent out the space for commercial event to generate enough money to, to cover the, cover the running expenses of the whole house. So we have a little bit more freedom of developing the art part of it. The restaurant has already become a popular place to hold events for the city's trendsetters, helping to provide Creek Art with a steady source of income. The gallery then uses this income to sponsor artists and projects. It's an unusual arrangement that is adapted especially for the Shanghai art market. To make it possible for young artists to, to show their artworks here. So that's the main aim for us. In many countries they, 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 get, so, uh, they get financial support from the government or the local government to, to run places like this. But China, China have their own system, so they have their the essential stages, but, the, but it's not many private-funded places in China like this, I think. If the theaters could either help us financially, that would provide more opportunity to us uh, to perform in that setting, which has um, technological advantages of lights, stage, curtain, all of these things. As Lisa and her husband Simon have said, they, along with their team, are trying to add to the cosmopolitan scene of Shanghai. Their efforts will involve more local and international talents as they help increase the exposure of contemporary art in the city.